that we created our workspace, let's also look at the settings on how we can manage our workspace. Then take a look all the way at the bottom where we see workspace settings. Once pressed, you will come towards your workspace settings overview. You can update your workspace logo to match your own business branding. You can also update your workspace name if you like to. And you can also update the time zone of your business. If we hover over the information icon, you will see that this will be the default time zone for all chatbots. If we go towards the next tab, you will come to the members overview. Once coming towards this tab, you will be able to send an invitation to invite a new workspace member. You can give it an email address, so you can send the invite by email, and you can then determine the role, either member or admin. More permissions will be added in the future, but for now we only have the members and admin. Once you inserted the email address, you will be able to send the invitation by pressing the button below that. Once the invitation has been sent, you will be able to see the mailed invitations by email address. And if you want to cancel the mailed invitation, you can go all the way down the right and press the trash icon. If we go over towards the channels, you will be able to hide the channel or set the maximum bots limit for each channel. If we go towards Facebook, for example, and go towards the dropdown, you will see that you will either be able to hide the channel or set the maximum bot limit to one. And this is depending towards your own plan. 